Hi friends, uh, Mike up uh, at Empty Mountain, and today I was uh, working on a project and I had to kill some trees, and I wanted to talk about it. The first precept of the Buddha is a follower of the Buddha does not kill, and in our tradition with under the Plum Village tradition with Thich Nhat Hanh, we say it's the first mindfulness training, which is reverence for life. And as I was killing these trees and delimbing them and skinning them, it reminded me very much of killing an animal and skinning an animal. And there's a, and I did not want to shy away from that. I wanted to connect with that, with the life of this tree and the beauty of it. And there's a loss, the loss of this tree life. And, and it reminds me that we're surrounded by these all, every day we're surrounded by these, these uh, dead trees. And so in reverence of that, I want to acknowledge that uh, that they're living beings that we're transforming into a new um, manifestation, and uh, they continue to take care of us, but no longer take care of us in their original form of life and green and uh, take care of our souls in that way, but they take care of us and physically and our souls in new ways. So just wanted to speak to the reverence of life and just show a little bit of the breaking down of this tree, the delimbing and de-skinning of this beautiful tree friend. This is a Douglas fir. And I just wanted to show a little bit of that. We can remove the limbs, almost like we're breaking down the carcass of a dead animal. It feels as much the same to me. And we, can act, we actually have to remove the skin. Much like removing the flesh from an animal. We're removing the flesh from the tree. And it peels. When we eat our food. And just a lot of uh, insights coming to me around um, using these tree friends in this way. When they're nice and fresh, freshly removed from their stump, the skin just peels off. When we have the living flesh here and the epidermis here, I can see clearly this is a living being. It's, uh, my hope is that we can 
keep it in mind on this uh, homestead, on this mindfulness community that we're taking these lives and building a continuation with them, but do it with a reverence and a non-forgetfulness of, of uh, what we're doing, of our impact. I love you guys. Uh, thanks for listening. <laughs>